as we take a look at the starting lineup, firstly with Tivoli Gardens here, Nicholas Clark uh, returns between the sticks, Keno Simpson, Odin Penicuth, Christopher Matthews and Dalton Lewis, the back four in the middle of the pack, Anthony Nelson, Anthony Thompson, Kevin Garnett and Justin Dunn, up top, Nakeel Wright and Rodika Wellington. Um, look out for Nakeel Wright, scored an absolute firecracker the last time Tivoli were here at this stadium. Of course, it was in a losing effort, but look out for him up top with Radiko Wellington, who has been finding his scoring boots as well, scored a lovely free kick a couple of weeks ago. So that's a tandem to look out for up top for Tivoli Gardens to try and see if they can get some goals and get the victory here today. As we take a look now at the starting lineup for Veer United, Roger Williams is the one between the sticks. Kimoy Phillips, Donovan Clark, Fitzroy Cummings, and Alwyn Strawn, the back four. In the middle of the park, we'll see Dove Dyer, Javier Brown, Fakibi Ferguson, Lamar Neal, and Orlando Lawrence behind new striker Romario Bryan. Well, for Very United, it's all about defense. They have the second best defense in the division despite being third to last. So look out for that back four to stay compact, not allow a lot of chances to the opposing team but then looking to spring counter-attacks and try and see if they can get some goals. They've only scored four this season, so the defence is really what they rely on to get their results and stave off this relegation. As we take a look at uh, some of the highlights here, the ball delivered inside for Nakeel Wright, who was in most of the action, Sky in that one. Then he found Wellington, who... In turn, also put it over the crossbar. Dunn's ball inside. Right again on the volley, hitting it flushed, was blocked. Roger Williams with a very poor clearance and right inside the area, forcing a save from Williams, who obviously made amends there. And then, very united with an opportunity. A scuff shot from Romario Bryan. No issues there for Nicholas Clark. And then right again, cutting it side, moving away from defenders and laid this one on a platter for Radika Wellington. And Wellington should have really done better there. Lewis. Oh. His reaction really sold it. And Alvin Strawn was sent off. Straight red card. And another opportunity there that forced Roger Williams to make in the save from Dunn. Then Pettycook with that delightful ball inside at the header was over the top. Here's Mackenzie again. Another chance, this one is tapped across the area, but Veer United managed to clear and then the shot from distance from Kevin Garnett. Again, over the crossbar. As we take a look at the statistics here, Tivoli Gardens with 15 shots, three on target. Veer United with just the one shot on target. They committed 10 fouls, four more than Tivoli Gardens. Two yellow cards were shown, one each. The one red card, pivotal, shown to Veer United's Alwyn Strawn. Uh, Tivoli had eight corner kicks, five more than Veer United. And the Tivoli also with the majority of the possession at 56%. Alton Lewis, today's man of the match. You got the clean sheet, but you just couldn't get the win today against your former team. Yeah, we create a lot of chance. But we just go back to uh, training and work while we finishing. Are we next match again, Tropical Maru, Monday night team. So, see if we can come out as a winner day, so. You're involved in the most controversial moment in the game, the red card. What happened there? <laughs> yeah. Why, him just... I'm just try to get that, try to make him get the red card, because it's not like a, him directly do it, but, but the eat of the game, so I'm just... You see it? <laughs> well, that, that happened. I'm assuming that you just want to just move on, try and get some wins for Tivoli, and push forward for the rest of the season. Yeah, we aim for finishing our top six, play quarter final, and see if we can start off from there. So, well, thank you, and good luck for the rest of the season. All right, thank you very much. Well, now we're moving on 